Okay, hello Ronnie. This video is for you to show you what I have. So these are two two of my solar panels. They should be 24 volts and about 80 watts. Uh, each cell is about. I should be getting 3. Point something amps. So 3. Point something times 24, 80 watts, about or 75. And you can see I'm connected right here to my voltmeter. I'm getting 2.85 amps. And so let's check the voltage. And if we get, uh, as you can see, I'm getting around 43 volts. So this is for simple, simple sake, 40 times 3, 120, 120 watts. And I'm using 8 gauge wires connected to these MC cables that I connected up. So I'll let, let me see, positive and negative. I mean, it's only five feet, so uh, the voltage drop shouldn't be that much. Connected up, negative, positive. There it is. Connected. Oops, I left it on. What I was doing that though? That was a big mistake. Oh well. Anyways, we'll see the wattage in a moment. And like I said, if you multiply three times forty, it should be one hundred twenty. But as you can see right now, with this watt kilowatt meter I have connected. The max I'm getting is around 60, or right now 57. So it's right now it's around 3 o'clock, and uh, you said I should get 90%. 90% of 120 is not this. This this is 40%. So I don't know what's up with your uh, inverter, and so that's the problem. I mean, I did use solid wire, a uh, uh, solid wire connected to the MC cables, uh, which were 10 gauge. And uh, I switched to 14 gauge just to see if any uh, uh, connection would get higher, but I don't see anything. And uh, I want to see your take on it.